more determined. Uh, there's obviously some disappointment uh, in the locker room. Uh, you know, uh, it hurt. It, it should hurt. Um, guys put a lot of time and, and a lot of effort into you know the game plan, and, and obviously through fall camp in the summer, and you want to get off to uh, to a good start. So uh, there's some disappointment there, but uh, I think now guys are are more determined and uh, you know really looking forward to uh, to a good effort this Saturday. You know, no one wants to lose their first game, and especially for me that was my first game in like two years so it kind of sucked, everybody was kind of down but we, we realized you kind of got to move on to next week, you know, put it behind us, realize what we can do better from that game to the next game. You know one loss isn't going to define our season, there's a lot of football left to be played and we're hoping that this season you know we can do some big things. about Connor is, uh, is it really matters to him. He takes a lot of pride in, uh, in playing defense here in North Dakota and uh, you know he's he's a guy that constantly wants to get better. Uh, you know I think you get to a certain point with some guys and, and they might feel like hey uh, I've reached the ceiling here or I know enough now I'm not going to learn anymore. He's always a guy that's constantly looking for new techniques, new strategies, uh, you know whatever edge he can find to get better he's going to use it. Yeah Connor's, Connor's an energy guy. I love him. He's a great captain, great linebacker, you know, a good friend. What I learned my first two years is that, you know, I was really tense when I was playing football and it really didn't help me. And I think the key, you know, that I've learned since I've been here is that you got to be relaxed. You got to have fun when you're playing football. You know, yeah, it's a pretty important game for a lot of us. And I, for me personally, I really love football and everything about it, but you got to be loose. You got to have fun out here. Uh, he's just hyper. It's just funny. You know, you got handshakes with everybody. You be screaming. Uh, I know last year before the home games, he'd just get everybody hyped up the day before and the day of. It was just, it's, he's a great guy. Funny. <laughs> well, uh, you know, before practice, uh, I got handshakes with everyone on the team and um, 6 a.m. runs. I'm always the guy banging on my roommate's door and just keeping high tempo. I play some weird music in the locker room to get the guys going and, um, you know, just when guys aren't expecting energy, I'd like to be the guy to bring the energy out. But, uh, we really put a lot of value here in guys that are they're the same guy every day and, and he's that. I mean, he's gonna, he's gonna put his time in, whether it's on the practice field, in the, fi in the film room, uh, you know, wherever, in the meeting setting to, uh, to make sure that he's successful on Saturdays. And it's just about executing one thing at a time uh, better than the day before and you know it starts off with Bowling Green and you know hopefully we can get a W there and then we come home for the potato bowl and that's going to be another big one and then conference play we just got to be ready to roll and take a step in the positive direction.